Hello, my beautiful souls, the Awakened Dreamer here to give you your daily tarot reading for Friday, August 5th, 2022. Thank you so much for joining me. Do keep in mind this is general for the day for all 12 signs, so just take what resonates. Do bear with the lighting. I hope it's okay, as well as my struggling voice. It is about 3 a.m. here, okay? Just feeling guided to do it at this time. But um, let's keep it simple, jump into it, and pull from the uh, Light Series Tarot. I'm hearing already staying in your lane, staying in your lane. So I feel, wow, that was such a struggle. <laughs> Bear with me. So the struggle could be alive throughout this day to an extent. But I feel there's a need to either keep to oneself at certain points of the day or simply just remember your path and don't uh, overwhelm oneself or over concern oneself with uh, what other people are doing, how they're going about doing something. Okay. What do we have for Friday? Okay. So we're just going to go with these two. Okay, so the Four of Swords and the King of Swords in this order. And so we'll build upon it. But I do feel like there's a focus on your independence, potentially money making, and feeling a bit burnt out to a certain extent, and not feeling as if it's possible to go at a fast pace. You may feel as if you're moving quite slowly while things are speedy around you. And then there's moments, spurts of energy that come about you spirits assisting you or you may feel as if uh, it's just you kind of snapping into it and then zoning back out or just feeling drained once again so for some drawn to this reading you could find your energy levels uh, uh, just kind of dip and then increase dip and increase go up and down throughout the day but for the most part you're feeling quite burnt out but I do feel like you're quite efficient getting down what you need to so don't allow the uh, uh, the ups and downs of your energy, the struggles in any way, shape, or form to get the best of you confidence-wise when it comes to accomplishing what you need to. But the Four of Swords and the King of Swords come out for the center. And I truly feel as if there's moments throughout this day where you are given a chance to rest, right? There's moments in the day where you're uh, put in the spotlight or just needing to use your knowledge and experience to decipher how to move forward or who and what to associate oneself with, right? Or how to accomplish what you need to once again. I do feel like there's a feeling of being watched over to an extent, whether that's authority figures uh, and or spirit. It could feel like just other people um, at the same level as you in a job, or it could be on an online platform. I feel as if there's positive and negative attention um, stemming towards you, but I do feel like there's also a focus on you needing to rest before you run towards something new. But in a smaller sense, I feel like a little bit of rest or some rest and relaxation, recovering before you head towards uh, something for the potentially the second half of the day or uh, the middle of the day. I do feel like um, there's a mode of transportation, if not two, being used throughout this day. Okay. But I do feel as if you're. Uh, soaring towards new heights whether it feels like it or not it's evident through the eyes of others but you're just feeling a little bit perplexed or a little bit out of it at times just kind of uh, I feel like for some drawn to this reading there's certain mundane tasks or routines it feels repetitive in one way shape or form in a, a daily routine sort of sense and in a smaller uh, task sense but I do feel like you're being noticed in a lot of ways, even celebrated, praised for what you know and have uh, somewhat or fully mastered at this point along your path. You're going places is what I'm getting. Uh, 1414 is just what I got. And I was looking at the timestamp and it was 414, but I got 1414. So there's going to be moments like that in the day. So look up that ancient number, meaning 1414. Um, but I do feel as if you're going to look at something and see something different throughout the day. Spirits at work, needing to just digest what you are meant to and not what others would see or I want to say even hear, okay? Um, mishearing will be purposeful is now what I'm getting. But um, I do feel like in the midst of all of which, 
the developer, the creator within you is coming to the surface, being put to use. I do feel you're meant to think thoroughly about where to put your your game piece, if you will, right? Um, others feeling quite s sly or thinking they are uh, in your midst. It feels like not all that you're wrapped up with are truly trustworthy, but I feel as if you have a good sense at this point as to who to open up to, who to share with, and who just to um, listen to when they speak, but then just kind of move right along to the next moment, the next situation, next conversation, uh, and not over speak, over share, and just take what you need to, and even um, just impress all the meanwhile. I feel as if there's a level of jealousy in the air, okay? Um, but I do feel as if you are um, overly serious at certain points and just questioning a lot, questioning others, questioning what you're hearing, what you're seeing, but when it comes to spirit, try not to question too, too much when it comes to others in your midst. Yeah, I feel as if that's quite accurate to, to question, not to accept it right off the bat. But it's like you're using the past to your advantage, also using the past to base whether or not to question uh, what's being said or certain actions. I feel like you're better than others, okay? That's coming through. Um, in more than one way, don't be surprised if there's certain levels of itchiness at certain points in the day where your body is just randomly itchy. And it's just like, okay, thank you, spirit. Um, maybe they're purposely trying to distract you or just annoy you. Regardless, it, do expect it. But um, you're manifesting all the meanwhile. I do feel like with the Eight of Wands, you're um, needing to recognize why so much is coming towards you. Um, in a positive sense but then also in a negative sense it's like people see you're going places see that you can easily accomplish something see that you just uh potentially do it better than them and therefore it's come you're being acknowledged needed uh utilized questions have come towards you for your uh due to your experience all right but i do feel as if you are uh overthinking at certain points but then very much simplified in the mind at others. I just feel like opposites attract throughout this day. Interesting. Wow, I mean, it feels like it could be that a day where there's that slow struggle, right? You know, when th you've, you're moving so slowly because you're, um, okay, overwhelmed or just so tired, depleted, that things just become a little bit of a struggle, but you don't overly stress over it because that's just your state of being at that time or throughout the day in general. But then again, it, it does feel like there's gonna be that fast movement around you and a lot coming towards you. But it, it feels as if the, the way of being for whoever's drawn to this reading, um, as I was just describing it, is going to help you not over stress again, okay? It's just gonna, you just do what you gotta do when you gotta do it in your own way and it works, okay? It just works. And I, again, I feel like people are impressed. Okay, completions on the horizon, keep that in mind. I do feel as if you're needing to um, allow for oneself to dig for the inner strength when need be, okay? And just allow for yourself to uh, stay passionate and recognize the souls, the um, communication that's effective, the souls that you're touching in a positive light. All right, actually they want me to clear this real quick and pull one other small spread, which is so rare for me. But I did this for myself in a personal spread. One more shuffle real quick. There's no rush. There's no rush throughout this day. Keep that in mind. What else do we have for Friday? The devil and the moon, okay? I feel as if there's a push to think back to some toxic energy and why it made you emotional. Whether that was, say, a customer, a, an authority figure, spirit it could be multiple situations i do feel like there's certain levels of emotion that you're still coping with dealing with but it reminds you why there's change on the horizon why uh you can't stick with something forever or just why you need to heal okay you may feel as if um there's a level of controlling to a certain extent or just um it feels as if you're needing to just do what you got to do water what you need to water and trust that things are meant to uh, vibe differently moving forward okay um, you'll miss what you're leaving behind but it feels as if there's 
a focus or a need to be focusing on where you're happiest moving forward, okay? Where you're more fulfilled. And even in moments of emotion or moments of uh, even mystery, I feel the need to say, being secretive or just strategic with certain levels of toxicity in the air or just uh, other sneaky behaviors, uh, untrustworthy people, once again, uh, jealousy, I feel you're uh, keeping this Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles situation on one's mind. And you're even achieving a level of fulfillment to a certain extent, um, again, all the meanwhile. But I do feel like um, it's like you want someone to adjust their perspective, but don't get your hopes up. Don't get your hopes up. I feel you need to just uh, at times adjust your own perspective in um, in moments of, okay, just emotion. Let's just put it that way. Or overthinking once again but I do feel as if it's a day where you could feel a bit spacey once again with the page of cups you could feel as if the spaciness leads to overthinking or over spiritual uh, communication and I feel there could be some visuals when it comes to your spiritual connection um, somebody wants you to tell them what's going on um, or just uh, talk to you more and it's this when pigs fly kind of situation I feel like they did you wrong in the past but I do sense that you're expecting the worst in a situation but it feels quite again based on the past or just um, I feel it's accurate honestly but I do sense that you're drifting to another situation where potentially one that you already know is coming to be in the future happiness sunnier days there is sun throughout this day so do remember how that benefits you um wow another itch and i do feel as if there's just certain levels of stress that again remind you why things need to switch up okay uh, a part of life that reminds you where we need to improve replace and just uh, shift towards the new once again i do sense that you're going to once again need to embrace the slow way slow way of being so you don't over or further burn oneself out okay uh, it's a day where you're going to just need to be and accomplish what needs to be uh, accomplished and do it well okay so i hope this reading was truly helpful don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't done so already go have yourself an amazing friday and i'll see you next time Bye.